I know Nick kind of made a video about this. My metalcore song went viral. It's got 2 million views on TikTok. How the fuck did I not fucking hear about that? All right, let's see what it's about. Here, I welcome to you 578. Wake up! Okay. Taylor told me there's a black in this one. Gotta have an O for a metalcore song, 100%. It's a good touch, Taylor, good touch. Yep. Yep. Ooh, I love those those yell screams there. Gives it some melody. Those lows. Right here. Not yet. This is definitely metaphor. Love that. Yes. Breakdown time, obviously. <laughs> Come on. Yes! Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. I can see why I went viral. Woo! Ooh. Ooh. A little Earl transition? Uh, that chorus reminds me of something too. That had that black counter up. <laughs> I love this guy. Nice solo. Let's go. Let's go, Taylor. Oh, you speak to me. Damn, that was a lot of fun. Yeah, definitely like that old school metalcore vibe, which is awesome. Uh, I think I like maybe see I saw like a little bit of a clip or something like that on like shorts of like how to write a metalcore song in 30 seconds from Nick Nocturnal. I think that might have been one of the riffs that he was in there. I don't know if that's part of that song, but I'm glad he kind of made it into a song. I believe it's up on Spotify and everything as well. But as soon as it dropped, Taylor's in my DMs like, yeah, I got a big fat bluff for you. I'm like, bro, I'm like, since it's dropped, I've had like 30 people fucking tag me in it and send me the video. And he's just like, yeah, I love it. Uh, really solid dude. I, I really like this guy. He's got a lot of really good energy and everything. And I listened to his podcast on uh, Metal Burbs there. And uh, he just seems like a really sweet guy and just uh, a very uh, he's been through a lot, too. So like just to kind of hear his story, uh, I love hearing that stuff, especially with bands and that. Definitely go listen to it if you haven't already. It's a, it's a good one. I would love to chat with them as well and just vibe with them. But I believe they're coming through Toronto. If you guys are in the area and if you're yeah, if you guys are in the area, definitely come see it. 
Uh, they're playing with uh, Chelsea Grin, uh, Carnifix, Left of Suffers on there, and there's another band as well. I just don't know who it is. So hoping to meet up with this guy and uh, get into that show. It'd be a lot of fun. Do another vlog video. It's just a banging time. So uh, you checked this out yesterday. It was fucking good. Yeah, it was definitely a, a really good song. That blah, obviously, was fucking golden, too. Uh, Taylor knows how to do it, for sure. Uh, Nick was really good with it as well. Obviously, the guitar stuff. Uh, I'm not a huge guitar person. I can't really say what the fuck is what. But this the 578 just sounds like that typical kind of like uh, chord progression, I guess. I don't know. Nope. I don't even know what the fuck it is. Uh, Christian can, tri bleh. Christian can probably tell me more about that. He plays guitar. Um, but yeah, the five, seven, eight kind of thing. The dun -dun 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 -dun. Maybe. I don't know. Just taking a wild fucking guess, but <laughs> really good song. It was really cool. Thank you for checking this one out.